Hello, this is Torior and welcome back to my Big Blue Blob Achievement Run. I have had a little rest and something to eat and now I'm ready to fight again. <laughs> right, that might be too much in detail. Anyway, let's and pause. We are fighting um, rebels right now. And also we are waiting for a claim on Kazan to fabricate so we can attack them. And I am still on my laptop so there might be a little bit of extra noise and a little bit more... Um, well less smoothness, I'd say, but it's fine. Continuing. Now, we only need 20 more provinces, mm, because we have 72. Eight of the Livonian order will be annexed relatively soon, so we only need 20 more. And I don't think we can get that in one war, but uh, two wars should be sufficient, because we are going to declare war on Kazan, and that will put us at war with Crimea. We don't want them co-belligerent, that would bring in the Ottomans. But, we'll take a couple of provinces from Crimea, let me just see how much we will be able to take. And this is 8 war squads, 6, 6... Yeah, I think we'll be able to take about, maybe, 8 provinces? 6 to 8 provinces, probably 6. Yeah, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Possibly seven? No, I'd have to count that. Okay, that's six, that counts as 12 war score if they're not co-belligerent. And that's seven, that counts as 14, that's 26. That's 12, uh, 38. Plus uh, 16, that's uh, 40, 54. Mm, plus five, that's 64, 74, 94, yeah. So it will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 provinces from Crimea, and that will leave us with 13 left. Mm, yeah, we'll take some from Kazan and then declare a war on someone else. I suppose we could fight Muscovy again by that time. No, our truce is going to take a little while longer. Alright, let's just unpause and do the thing. You guys, you guys can just wait here for the claim to fabricate so we can attack. No, rebel Uprising. Mm, Tverian Separatists, they are so far from rebelling, let's not worry about them. Cause are progressing, everything is coming up Millhouse. Right. Nobles ally with foreign power, lose prestige or lose admin. Mm, we don't need a Cassisbillion Muscovy, our prestige is very good. Yeah, I can lose the prestige now. It is not a problem. Since we have some time until the claim fabricates, let's just see when we'll be able to get um, the next military tech level. I could lose 30 admin and 5 diplo for 1 yearly prestige. Well, prestige do does give us some benefits, some morale and so on. Usually I wouldn't do it, but um, the morale um, bonus and so on, yeah. Probably we should have gone with the other option. Now that I consider it, that's what, yearly prestige, so that's 24 total prestige in the time frame. Um, you know what, well not 24, still some bonuses, oh right, let's do it. Yeah, I probably should have gone with the other option on the previous event as well. Just uh, keep the prestige high, so we get more morale. What's our army tradition anyway? It is pretty high, we have two generals, let's multiple all the forts so we don't lose money on that. Look at that, we're actually making cash now. The Ottomans are fighting Kerman, that does not concern us. Yeah. Oh, um, incidentally, Crimea has Circassia as a... Wait a minute, what did I do? Rebels. Yeah, sure. Circassia is a vassal of Crimea, so theoretically we could take those provinces instead and have access to Georgia. Georgia is a vassal of Karakoyunlu. Gazikumuk. Oh, Gazikumuk is allied with Kazan. So theoretically we could uh, annex them in a separate piece. Then we would need to take those provinces from Crimea. They have increased coin cost, but uh, they have less development. Yeah, I think that could work. That would be one, two, three, four... Mm, let's, let's not worry about it now. Let's wait until the war is underway. Right. And this army here... Wait, with the war, in the war with Kazan we probably need to peace out Crimea first, so let's move those armies south. 
or do we want to hit them hard and hit them fast? Let me see the fort level map mode. Yeah, they only have one fort. We could just uh, steamroll through the Kazani lands. Maybe that is the right choice. Yeah, you guys stay where you are. You move over here and you do the same thing. Then we can attack from two, uh, two sides. And this army should be sufficient to just wipe their unit over here. Okay, still need to wait a little bit longer. And rebels are not going to be a problem. Mm, the religious thing doesn't really concern us. Provincial unrest, yeah. Mm, we don't want to build buildings. Disputed succession also does not concern us. And we have a castle blade against Kazan. It's time to fight. So, uh, will Poland and Aragon still join us? Oh no, Aragon will join us in another war, it doesn't matter. Mm, right, we don't want Crimea as Kabul the Druid, because then the Ottomans might join. Let me just see if the Ottomans would join. Yes, they would. Okay, so we want Crimea in, but not Kabul the Druid, to make this war quick. Take Penza. We will have Gazikumuk and Crimea and Timurids, which could prove to be a problem, but we should be eclipsing them in uh, tech. Well, maybe it's too early to talk about eclipsing, but we should win. Okay, here we go. This is supposed to be speedrun after all, let's make it quick. Right, you guys go and wipe their, mm, their army. And this is actually a big fort. You have siege value. You have a bit of siege value. Okay, let's get you over there. And soon we'll be building cannons to hasten our sieges. Yeah, let's see the force balance. It is in our favor. Yeah, Lithuania has some claims on Crimea. Mm, we should actually we should try to get this before they do. Can I split this army now? I cannot. Let's uh, build some quick mercenaries. Just to you know, they should take care of their armies, but we would would want to at least assume siege of Bahmut first. Manso mm, not necessarily, but this province we want. <coughs> if Lithuania takes it, it's not really a problem, but still I would prefer to have it myself. Oh, we lost a general. Mm, not the good one, though. Alright, uh, let's select this army, take one unit back to our land and bring them back with a general. In the meantime, you guys shouldn't really be sitting here. We do need to explore, but uh, do it cautiously. I will split them in half. Then if we encounter somebody, they should be able to survive. And the Timurids will be coming, but it will take them some time. Uh, national Attacks Modifier, Manpower Modifier or Unrest. That's for five years. I suppose I can go with Tax Modifier. Right, those guys are ready. Just start sieging Bamut. So Lithuania doesn't take it from us. Yeah, we do want that province. And the rest they should be transferring because they only have claims on uh, what? One, two, and three. Mm, yeah. Okay, that'll be fine. Oh, I forgot to unmotable the fort. That is a problem. That is actually going to be a problem. I forgot to unmotable this. Can I do it now? Probably not. Hmm. Maybe I can... Uh, crap, we'll have to siege it down again. Okay, let's just send this unit there. Supplement it with uh, two more mercenary units. So we can just uh, kill the guys before they do anything else. Yeah, that was a mistake on my part. A slight one, but still a mistake. Let's do it uh, step by step. Oh, is there a fort over here? Can I not go directly into this province? Apparently not. Alright. Uh, France occupied Bahmut. Good. Now let's get those guys back here. And retake our fort. We'll need a new general. Um, generals, generals. Three. Yes. He's good. 
Mm, all right, let's just uh, assign him to this army. And they are actually maintaining this fort. Can they win if I attack with those guys? Probably not, but maybe they can hold out until the reinforcements come. Since they will have a very good general. And we don't want them taking control of our fort in the long term. Well, we have more morale and more tactics and a better general, even though they have superiority in numbers. So we should be able to hold out until the reinforcements come. Or not. We did. Good. Okay, so um, the garrison is minimal. But still, we need to wait for a breach to appear before we can assault. Okay, that is fine. And you guys are just... Uh, Okay, let's let them do their thing. Explore and conquer. Will Poland help with the siege? Oh, Poland, you are not transferring control to us. Oh, this... We cannot allow that. Allow that. We need control for ourselves. Poland, you should have transferred that to me. I want that for myself. I think we need more mercenaries. Yeah, that is going to be a problem. Should at least cut them off. This is not a crucial province to us. But I, still, I would prefer to have it. They should have transferred it to us already. Well, we can always wait for them to sign a separate peace, but I would like to make this war relatively quick. Right. Mm, you guys continue exploring and try not to get killed. Circassia has come. At least they are transferring stuff in Kazan to us. Yeah, let's make sure that we are the ones who occupy those provinces over here. Lower Don, Tsaritsyn, Azarab... Mm, Azaraba. Okay, they took tin, which is actually good for me, because I will retake it. Uh, Novgorod has cancelled military access. Doesn't matter to me. Right, you guys, where, I sh where should I send you? Kazan actually has a lot of land, but some of it mm, will probably be counted as Asia already. This is still Europe, 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 Europe. No, it all counts as Europe. No, this doesn't. This does, this does, this does not. I wonder how much will I be able to take from you, Kazan? Let me just see. Stuff with the lowest war score. It's actually quite a lot. Yeah, we'll have to adjust it accordingly to only take European stuff and so on. For now, let's just let the war happen. Lower Don is ours. Now let's move to Tin. Oh, and we took back our fort. Perfect. This is taking an awfully long time. Mm, and they don't seem to have any more forts in this area. Let's just consult the fort map mode. Yes, no more forts. So the sieges will be instantaneous. Uh, right. Some more exploration. Who are, you, are we fighting anyway? Crimea, Gazakumu, Kashmir, Timurid, Circassia, Ardalan, and Kazan. All the tension against uh, Vladimir. Mm, so, Muscovy. Alright. I am fine with that. The free castle body against Muscovy is a good thing. Saritin has been occupied. And Tin is about to be occupied. We should probably move against uh, Circassia. Let's just uh, siege uh, Manik first. Mm, this is high development. You can have it, Poland. We don't really need it. Oh, they're going to lower Don. We do have better forces. We have a better general. So let's just go there and stop them. Also, help from this unit. Just to make it quicker. Now, um, we have taken their capital. 
We can now disperse this army. We'll disperse. We can just move this army over their territory, taking all the provinces really quickly. So, one, two, and so on. Yeah, I think we're doing pretty well. We have a lot of time left. And only need a few more provinces. Right. Kazan is about to be full sieged. Lower Yik has been occupied. And we're not fighting Noga, which is down here. Nor are we fighting Uzbek. The Timurids, well, I'm not sure if they can cross it. Because we don't have military access from Nogai or Uzbek. Maybe Kazan does. But if they hate each other, that would mean that the Timurids wouldn't be able to reach our territory. Mm. Sweden wants military access from us. Sweden, who are you fighting again? You're fighting nobody. They're only allied with Oldenburg, no longer with Novgorod. What about Norway? Denmark and Denmark. Norway, Brandenburg and Utrecht. Let's just uh, focus on our war for now. But you can have military access, Sweden. Why not? All right. Now taking the fortress um, in Crimea will actually take some time. I hope Poland does that for, um, does that for us. We've occupied Manic. Where was that? Here. Yeah, this is pretty straightforward. Oh crap! 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 Can you can you stop? No, we cannot. Right, we'll need to reinforce them then, because this army just appeared. We occupied Archali. Where is that? The truce with the Livonian Order has ended, but we are already annexing them. Okay, uh, let's send those guys to the regions that are not being sieged due to some attrition having happened. Mm, yeah, let's just uh, switch this around. You go there, you go there, you go there. Okay, we might, we might have to wait for the Timurids to be willing to peace out to get a good deal. Still, we will get a lot of uh, war score from controlling the war goal. And we still have to wait for all of uh, this area to be sieged, because we do want stuff from Crimea. So we will probably need to get them to 100% war score. Okay. We don't really need to do anything else here. We will need to move into Circassia and Gazikumuk. So let's take those armies there. One of you will siege Circassia. Mm, Crimea itself is being sieged already. I think I will send some troops there. Just so mm, if for some reason our allies decide to leave, the siege will not be broken. And you guys can kill the small Crimean army over here in Kuban. Okay, we took a couple of more provinces, which is wonderful. We can now mm, attack Novgorod. Nobles that demand privileges, privileges. Well, yeah, we can lose the prestige. It's not that important. It is important, but not that important. Certainly, we're not going to take plus two unrest everywhere. <coughs> Cruelty of mercenaries. Lose prestige or local unrest everywhere for three years. Well, not everywhere, but still. Yeah, that could cost us some money. Mm, Alright. Can I move from here? Yes, I can. Let's first siege the province. Yeah, this is... This is going to be fine. Mm, the fortress in, in Circassia will take some time to fall. And we have actually occupied everything Kazan has. We are only at 21% war score though, because of their allies. Who we will take care of very soon. France occupied Yedishko. Good. Let's send you guys over here. I can send you guys over here. Well, I could with the transport ships. It's not necessary. Let's just move them to Circassia instead. And you guys... You guys can move on over here to Gazikumuk. Which. Right, let's do that. That, and you go here. 
it's perfect. I wonder if the Tumorids will be able to actually get here. If they do, it will complicate things a little bit, but only a little bit. Oh, a revolt. A revolt could be problematic. Hmm. Also, uh, actually, it's time to end the episode now, so thank you very much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you liked the video, and I hope you did. And I will see you in the next one very soon. Goodbye.